Hi guys, welcome back to a new video. I hope you're all doing really well. Today, we're gonna be trying out the Revolution Roxy uh, collection that she recently came out with. I've got um, her palette, also got some brushes. I also did get other little bits from Makeup Revolution that we'll try, but we're just gonna create a, a cute little look you know today's post notification shout out is going to go to Aisha Mia so thank you so much for your really sweet comment and your ongoing support I really appreciate it and if you guys want to get one next time all you have to do is subscribe press the bell button let me know in the comments below when you've done so or you can just leave a nice comment I'm just I'm just dying to get into this video and put a bit of makeup on I'm just going to fill in my brows out I literally can't do with my brows without a bit of like the got to be gel like it's like I don't know how to do my brows without now I should try to give them like some soaps a go. Okay, so the first thing we have here is her cute little brush set that looks really, really nice. So you get two of the sponges, which looks like this. These are what the brushes look like, but they're really, really soft. I'm first using a little bit of a uh, Tarte Shape Tape on my lid to act as a base. Okay, so this is what the packaging looks like. It's got some like wool effect on it. And then once you open it, you've got some pretty uh, shimmery shades and like this is a deeper shade in a palette. I wish there was more deeper shades to be honest, but it's a really pretty palette and I love that there's some glitters in there, some like pale matte, some browns, mauves. I think the first shade I'm going to take is this one right here called Hot Chocolate. I'm really tempted to take this pinky shade called Nap Time. We're just gonna blend the edges out with this. I'm gonna take a deeper shade called Leaves. Concentrate that on the outer corner. I mean, I wish it was a bit deep, like. I mean, for my skin tone, when you think darker, I just don't think like it's deep enough for sure. Like, but everything's blending out really nicely. This is definitely more for like a more subtle look. I'm gonna use that shade Nap Time to just blend out the edges. I'm gonna grab some of my NYX glitter glue, and we're just gonna put that all over. I'm going to use the shade Toasty with my finger. Just kind of like a base for the glitter, but this is like so pigmented. So I'm going to take Dazzle, which is like a proper glitter shade. Guys, can you see that glitter? It's so pretty. Okay, so she did also come out with an eyeliner pen. If I'm honest with you guys, I'm not the biggest fan of these uh, pen eyeliners, but we'll give it a go. That's not a bad eyeliner. I mean, I literally did that in like, what, a minute, less than a minute. Just gonna clean up this little mistake I made here. So Makeup Revolution also came out with this 5D mascara, which I'm really excited to try out. So that's what the brush looks like. It's a little bit curved. It's gripping really well, but there's not much product going on there. You know, I just know when like a mascara is not working for me, like. Yeah, not, not a fan. I know how mascara should apply to me and like this is just not it. So she also came out with these synthetic lashes. They're thinner and smaller than I'm used to. Oh, it's not too bad actually, it shows up on me. I didn't think this was gonna show up on me. Okay, that's the lash on and it's actually really, really pretty. I love how it's like a little wispy lash. Um, I'm gonna do the other eye and I'll be right back. Okay, I've done both of my eyes and I'm I'm in love with the look. I just wish there was a, a, a bit more, I just wish there was more deeper matte in the palette. But I'm trying to take this liner off my hand and it's literally not coming off like, 
I'm having to rub so hard. It, it came off in the end though, but yeah, the eyeliner I'm actually pretty pleased with. It's really black and it's really easy to work with. Yeah, so I'm really pleased with the, the liner for sure. Um, and the lashes are actually really pretty. I definitely see myself wearing these. They're more like everyday lashes. Love them and I can barely feel them on my on my lids. I'm gonna use my Laura Mercier Tinted Moisturizer in the shade Almond. I just dropped another thing. Like, I don't know how many things I've dropped throughout this video. But yeah, I'm just gonna put this all over and we're gonna use the sponge to blend this all out. I must say like the sponge is huge and it's so soft. Like literally who needs a beauty blender these days? Like all these drugstore brands are coming out with really, really good sponges. I mean, that blended out really well. This base is really light, by the way. It's like a tinted moisturizer. I really like it. Um, and I'm gonna use my Tarte Shape Tape as concealer. Yeah, sponge is really, really good. I really like it. I definitely see myself using it more. Okay, I'm also going to put some of this uh, Visionary Gel Liner by Makeup Revolution. This one's in the shade Burgundy. I just want like to have like a nice red lower lash line. I'm kind of doing it in my waterline and like on my lower lash line too. Ooh, that's pretty. I don't know what the hell that is under my eye. <laughs> Why? <laughs> but yeah, this look, this lip is going with this look, so. All right, guys, this is the finished look. I'm actually really happy with the whole look. The eyeshadows are gorgeous. I love the glitter, but I just wish there was some more deeper mattes in the palette. Like, it's not some a palette I would reach out for like a whole look like I, I would just reach out for some of the metallics and the glitter shades in there but the metallics are like buttery so yeah I, I love the quality and most of the shades in there I just wish wish there was deeper mattes in there which is an important thing for me to have in a palette okay there are also some um candles that I received I don't know these are part of the Roxy collection but the first one we have here is called under the covers it's a scented candle with warming floral and pink pepper and patchouli i can't say like this is my favorite though i'm really specific with the scents i like but this smells like men's deodorant do you know what this is not a bad one to keep in like the downstairs toilet you know as decoration it's really pretty but yeah i'm not the biggest fan of the scent yeah i don't think this was part of the roxy collection the next one we have is your my type i love the packaging it's like this beigey color this one's okay fresh and aromatic amber and bergamot not the biggest fan it smells very florally i love more sweet scents like sweet musky scents that's my, my favorite kind of scent Oh, this one I might like. This one is a fruity and floral rhubarb and peony. It's like a pinky mauvey one. Oh, this one's not bad. This one's called Me Angel. <sighs> this one's nice. I like this one. This one reminds me of the, what's it called? Jo Malone Pomegranate Noir. Just a little bit. So yeah, I actually really like the br uh, the the brushes. I use this blush for my cheeks and it's just really soft. So yeah, I'm really happy with the brushes and the sponges are really, really soft. The eyeliner was really good too. I love that it's like really hard to take off. So you know, it's just gonna last all day long. Yeah, I'm just a bit iffy about the palette. Like I said, I just wish there were deeper shades, but the quality and the pigmentation is not bad for what they are. But for my skin tone, I just needed a bit more, you know? A bit more. Uh, really like the lashes so yeah I'm, I'm overall really pleased and I just want to give like these metal these uh, gel eyeliners they come in so many shades but they're so creamy and I love the effect that is given like on my lower lash line and for my lip I'm actually wearing this matte liquid lipstick in the shade Gone Rouge 
by Makeup Revolution. So yeah guys, if you enjoyed this video, please give it a big thumbs up. Let me know what you want me to try next. Subscribe to my channel if you're new here. I hope you enjoyed this little try on video. Um, I'm so hungry. I haven't eaten all day, like all day. I'm just so hungry. I'm gonna order some good butter chicken and naan, I think. Yeah, I love you guys so much and I will see you in my next video.